This is the second episode of Wet Noses and Fire Hoses. I'm Richard, and this, uh, this is Potato right here. And as you can tell, she is one fantastic little dog. Look at this. Is it not pure love? I mean, this is one sweet baby. I've been with uh, Williamson Fire Rescue for 16 years, and I've been in dog rescue also. And let me tell you, a rescue dog is worth their weight in gold because they appreciate you like you have no idea. Uh, I got three of my own right now. I've had 11 of them, and they, uh, they're just, there's nothing like a rescue dog. They are loyal, faithful, and they just, they'll love you to death. That's the bottom line. I'd like to make a couple of statements about safety. If, you're, if, you're, if you've got dogs in your house, go ahead and leave them in a room close to the door so that in case you have a fire and you're not home, when the fire department comes, they'll see them. It's also good that they have a collar on, a leash on, or a leash there in the house that, uh, you can, that the fire department can hook up to them and used to get them outside the house. Uh, like I say, we don't want any, any dogs to suffer in a fire whatsoever or any other kind of emergencies. So a lot of the fire departments carry the, the oxygen for the, for the dogs in case of a dog emergency, but hopefully we'll never have to use that. This is Potato and she is available for adoption from the Williamson County Animal Control Center. And you couldn't ask for a better dog. The time that I've spent with her right here, yeah, I can tell she is one fine little animal. And you know, she's six years old again, and like good with kids, good with other dogs, good with cats. You wouldn't, you wouldn't go wrong with this baby right here. That's for sure. You know, rescue dogs have had a hard time but they're the most faithful animals you can get. So, again, thank you very much for watching this episode of Wet Newses and Fire Hoses. And hopefully, somebody will come down and get this little baby. Thank you very much.